I'm Sammy and welcome to Smiles AG. Today I'm going to be doing my most requested video and it is an All My Dolls video. So let's get this started. Before I start, I'd like to introduce my dog buddy. Isn't he so cute? Okay, so this is my very first doll and yes, she is an our generation doll. She's not an American Girl doll, but I had to include her because she's very important to my love for dolls. When I first got Lily, I didn't really like dolls. My mom wanted to get an art generation to make sure I liked dolls. And when I got Lily, I probably played with her for a week and then I was totally done with her. And maybe a year or two later, I had a friend who was obsessed with American Girl dolls. And one day I just went over to her house and she just started to play dolls with me. And I fell in love with them and I brought Lily and I started to play with Lily again to the point where I got so obsessed with dolls and I wanted an American Girl doll so I decided that I was going to go to an American Girl doll place to get my very own American Girl doll. So if I wouldn't have had Lily, I never would have my entire collection. Love you. My first American Girl doll was Julie Albright. I got her in the American Girl doll play Seattle and it was so amazing. I have so many great memories there. I just love Julie so much. I also was in a fashion show as Caroline, but I auditioned with Julie and that was super fun. But I love Julie and she's honestly one of my favorite American Girl dolls. She just means so much to me. She also was Jojo Siwa in Dance Moms and Chloe Lucasiak. This is my third doll, Emma. She is my look-alike. I got her off eBay for pretty cheap. She's so beautiful. When I had my three sisters, I drew this picture of them. And it's really funny and really cute and it means so much to me. The next doll I got is Caroline. I got Caroline for my birthday and I'm so glad that I got her because she is a retired historical doll. And when I found out that Caroline was being retired, I was so sad. She's such a beautiful doll. She has such amazing hair and her eyes are to die for. I love Caroline and I'm so glad I got her. My next doll is Samantha Parkington. Samantha has such a special place in my heart. When I was in first grade, I didn't have any American Girl dolls, and I saw these books that were about Samantha. And of course I had to read it because my name's Samantha. So I read the book and I fell in love with Samantha. On the back of the book, it had a picture of a doll, and I had to get her. But I was so devastated when I found out she was retired. So when she came out from the archive, I was so excited to get her for Christmas. My friend Delaney gave me this next doll, and her name is Olivia. She loves nature, and she's also a twin doll to Emma. As you can see, she is in a wheelchair. That is because I received her with very loose limbs. However, I can fix her limbs, but I just love her in a wheelchair, and that does not stop her because she's in multiple of my videos. She's in Dance Moms episode two, and she's also in Dance Moms Episode 6 as an announcer. Well, I hope you're not falling asleep like Buddy here, but we're going on to the next doll. This is Natalie. My dad was working out of state, and he went to the American Girl doll place, Kansas City, and he sent me this doll. I was so excited and surprised when I got her. She has beautiful red hair and gorgeous green eyes. It's like Christmas with glasses. I love her. It's Christmas with glasses. Moving on, we have Ben. As you can tell, he is not in the American Girl doll product line, but he's my only boy doll and I had to include him. I got Ben from my Nana, which he was my great grandma's doll, so it's really special to me. He is an amazing boy doll and I'm so glad that I have a boy doll. The next doll is Nellie O'Malley. Nellie is a retired American Girl doll who is Samantha Parkington's best friend. I really wanted to get Nellie to improve my collection. So I went on Craigslist and I found a super cheap Nellie O'Malley doll. I was so excited. So I went to go get Nellie and sadly the appointment was canceled. 
but I was not giving up. So I went home and I was looking for this doll on eBay. My neighbor was looking, my family was looking. It was crazy. But eventually, we found Nelly. This next doll is Rebecca Rubin. This doll also was shipped to me from my dad and it was another surprise. So thanks dad for so many surprises from the Kansas City American Girl doll store. Rebecca, as some of you may know, is an actor, and I'm also an actress, so we have a lot in common. I was recently Jane Banks and Mary Poppins, and it was so much fun. And Rebecca here, she is one of my biggest actors in all of my AGS Sims. She plays Allie Lee Miller in Dance Moms. If you haven't seen her, go check her out. She did amazing. This next doll is Kanani. No, that, that's really weird. This next doll is Kanani on Dance Mom. She played Kalani. Her and I will play the ukulele. 2011 Girl of the Year. She has really, 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 really long hair. next doll means so, so much to me. I was blessed with the opportunity to go up to Seattle to meet YouTube sensation Rosanna Pansino. If you haven't heard of her, her links will be down below. Go check her out. I love Ro, and when I met her, it was an amazing opportunity. She's so sweet. And, of course, since I was in Seattle, I had to go to the American Girl doll store, and I had to get a doll that looked like Ro. So, this is my American Girl doll, Rosanna Pansino. I made a video of her in her kitchen doing Nerdy Nummies, so that video was super fun, and if you haven't seen it, go check that video out. I love Ro. You ain't nothing but a hound dog, crying all the time. Oh, hey guys, I'm just jamming out with Mary Ellen, my 50s doll. I love the 50s, and Mary Ellen is pretty awesome. I got Mary Ellen over spring break with my friends at the American Girl doll store, Seattle. This next doll is Leah Clark. She's the girl of the year, 2016. I was able to have the amazing experience to go to VidCon, and an hour down the road is the American Girl doll store in Los Angeles. So of course I went and I got Leah Clark. She also plays Maddie in my Dance Moms videos. The next doll I'll be showing you is Peyton Hope. Peyton is such an amazing doll. I got her at the American Girl doll store, Kansas City. She has amazing blue eyes, the cutest freckles, and adorable hair. Overall, I love this doll. She's personally one of my favorite dolls. This next doll is Jory. She's a renamed Willow Welly Wisher. She is named after my cousin, who is a colonel in the Air Force. We're all so proud of her for serving our country, and this doll looks just like her. She also played Mackenzie in my Dance Mom video, and she also starred as herself in Adopt a Dog. The next doll is Kit Kitridge. Kit is a Be Forever doll that I got in the American Girl doll Kansas City store. I love Kit. I've always thought Kit was such a cute doll. I love her little bob and her freckles. I love her movie. She just is such an inspiring doll and I had to get her. Moving on to my next doll. This is Colleen Ballinger. I love the Ballinger so much. They're a big YouTube sensation. There's a ton of different Ballingers. There's Colleen, Christopher, Rachel, and all the kids. I love them all. So of course I had to get Colleen, which you guys may know as Miranda Sings, Miranda Sings. I even made a video of Colleen, aka Miranda, meeting the Dance Mom Girls. And Colleen loves the Dance Mom Girls, so I thought it would be extremely fun. Sometimes Miranda can be really goofy and say some offensive things, but it's all in fun. And I just love Colleen, and of course I had to get a doll of her, so... This next doll is Melody Ellison. 
I was so excited when Melody came out. She's such a cute doll. And I got her for my birthday, which was super exciting. And along with her, I got her studio, which is so exciting. And in future episodes, you will be seeing that. So stay tuned. I'm sure you all recognize Faith. Faith is an our generation doll that I found at a thrift store. It broke my heart to see a doll that didn't have a home and that was going to be thrown in the trash can soon. So I had to get her and fix her up and now she's pretty cute. I even made a video of me fixing her and if you want to see that I'll leave links down below so you can check it out. Meet Bailey Ballinger. She's a renamed Camille Wellywisher who will be starring in another stop motion episode really soon. Now moving on to Cammy. Cammy has reasons why I named her Cammy, and it's because for some reason, no matter what I do, she's always staring at the camera. She's so cute and I love her. She played Nia in Dance Moms, so if you haven't seen her, go check her out. She did a great job. Last but not least, my giveaway doll. Though she won't be mine for much longer because she's going to one of you guys on Valentine's Day. I'm so excited. I'd like to thank you guys because I just reached 800 subscribers. I'm so excited. I can't believe that I've gotten this far. You guys are amazing. If you want to enter to win this doll, I will leave links down below so you can access my video where I talked about the giveaway. All you have to do to enter is like that video, subscribe to Smiles AG, and comment something why you would want to win this doll. I'm so excited. I love you guys so much. Bye! And Willow, I forgot her name. Her, like, it's Willow Wellywisher.